The Hebrews, 1800 to 587 BC. The Hebrews first settled in Palestine around 4,000 years ago. They came to Palestine from Ur, although no one knows exactly why they came there before then. Their name meant the people from the other side of the Euphrates River. Their story is told in the Bible. According to the Old Testament, the leader of the first Hebrews was Abraham, a shepherd who lived in Ur. Abraham traveled with his family first to Syria and then to Canaan, now Palestine, where they finally settled. Early years. Abraham's grandson Jacob, also called Israel, had twelve sons. He is said to have started the twelve tribes of Israel, which were named after his sons. When famine struck Canaan, Jacob led his people to safety in Egypt. Later, they became slaves of the Egyptians until Moses led them out of Egypt and took them back to Canaan, probably about 1200 BC. There, led by Joshua, they fought the Philistines for the right to settle and establish the land of Israel. Tradition has it that they used the sound of trumpets to bring down the walls of the city of Jericho. The first state of Israel. Around 1020 BC, the Philistines began to threaten the Hebrews. To defend themselves, the Hebrews banded together and appointed Saul their first king. His successor, David, united all the tribes, made Jerusalem the new nation's capital, and added a number of other territories. As defensive measures, his son, Solomon, built several new cities and a wall around his capital. The great temple at Jerusalem is his most famous work. He was peace-loving and wise. According to the Bible, Solomon was a wise king. It is said that two women came before him with a child, each claiming to be its mother. Solomon suggested that he cut the child in two so each mother could have half. One woman broke down and gave up her claim. Solomon recognized her as the true mother and gave her the child. His reign has marked the peak of Israel's history. After he died, his people argued and divided into two nations, Israel and Judah. Troubles and Dispersion After a rebellion by the Israelites, the Assyrians captured Israel in 721 BC and then Judah in 683. The Jews scattered in several directions, and many were carried away to Assyria as slaves. Nebuchadnezzar of Babylon crushed Jewish rebellion in 597 BC, and most of the Jews were taken to Babylon. During that exile, much of the Old Testament of the Bible was written down. This is the beginning of the Diaspora, the dispersion of the Jews, which lasted into the 1900s.